Thanks for watching TechWiki. Click the subscribe button, then enable notifications with the bell icon so you won't miss any future videos. We've all been there. You're on a business call, you're making plans for the evening, or you're chatting up that girl you like when suddenly, boop, the line is deader than Paris Hilton's singing career. And here we are. It's 2017, 48 years after the alleged moon landing, and we still haven't figured this out. What gives? Well, there are actually a lot of variables in the average cell phone connection. There can be signal handoff problems if you're on the move and switching from one tower to another. Phone antennas are now buried inside the device rather than sticking out like they did back in the ancient 1990s. Um, at places like sporting events or concerts, tons of people uploading selfies at the same time can overload a cell tower. And of course, the world is full of materials like thick concrete that don't exactly get along with phone signals. But let's say that you're like, you know, kind of like an important person that needs to like stay connected at all times. How can you give your signal a boost? Surely there's a better solution than sitting by a window or stepping outside to take a call. You bet there is. One increasingly popular method is to bypass cell towers entirely. Many cell providers have recently begun offering Wi-Fi calling as a free add-on. This uses your home or office Wi-Fi connection to place your call over the internet instead of the cell tower network. To use it, verify that your cellular plan provides you with Wi-Fi calling, then enable it on your phone, like this on iOS and like this on Android. Now, Wi-Fi calling can drop out if you move away from your hotspot during a call, but because a voice over IP or VoIP connection can carry much more data than a standard phone network, it supports much higher call quality, including HD voice, which you can learn more about here. Option number two is to use a gadget called a femtocell or microcell or network extender. This is a dedicated box that connects to your home internet connection. But instead of providing your phone with a signal over Wi-Fi, it instead generates the same kind of signal that you would get directly from the tower. Then it uses the internet to connect to your carrier's network. This can be a decent way to go if you're using older equipment that doesn't support Wi-Fi calling, but these things can be costly at around $200 each, and you'll need to ensure that your model of fem to cell supports your specific carrier. Adding insult to injury, you may actually get charged a monthly fee to use it. And furthermore, although a phone will see a fem to cell signal the same way it would an ordinary signal from a cell tower, so there's no special setup required on your phone, some due diligence and configuration may be required to ensure that strangers can't connect to it. Bottom line, Wi-Fi calling is a much better solution unless you have equipment that you must use that simply doesn't support it. Okay then, what if you don't have a nearby internet connection to strengthen your signal? Well, then you probably need a signal booster, which can take even a weak cellular signal and amplify it into something that's strong enough for your phone to use. The downside to these is that you can't use them in an area that has no service at all, unlike Wi-Fi calling or a fem to cell. You'll also need something to power it, such as a car charging outlet. Signal boosters for homes and businesses are also available, and if you can afford one, they can be a great option for large buildings where there are a lot of people on many different carriers. Though, for the best results, you'll actually want the antenna outside, preferably on the roof, which, speaking from experience, can be a bit of a hassle. Of course, much of the frustration of having a weak signal can be avoided by simply ensuring that you sign up with a carrier who provides good service in the areas you'll be using it in the first place. And besides, maybe it's a little comforting to know that there are still a few holes in the big data machine of this brave new world. Speaking of frustration, do you find yourself racing against the clock as a freelancer? It's challenging, but thanks to the internet, and the fact that you can get it, you know, anywhere in your cell connection, whatever, don't worry about the segue. There's never been more opportunities to be self-employed. And for you guys out there, there's FreshBooks, the accounting software that's designed for the way you work. It's a simple, 
easy way to be more productive, more organized, and perhaps most importantly, get paid faster. You can create and send professional looking invoices in less than 30 seconds. It's all cloud-based so you can access it from anywhere, and I truly mean anywhere. It works on iOS and Android. You can set up online payments with just a couple of clicks and get paid up to four days faster. You can see when your client has seen your invoice and put an end to the guessing games. And you don't have to take my word for it. They're offering a 30-day unrestricted free trial to our viewers. So to claim it, go to freshbooks.com slash techquickie and enter techquickie in the how did you hear about us section. We'll have that linked below. So thanks for watching, guys. If you disliked this video, you can hit that button. But if you liked it, hit like, get subscribed, maybe consider checking out where to, wait, no, this is my LTT outro. Leave a comment with video suggestions, uh, check out our other channels, peace.